Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Leo August 21, 2024. Moon brings your feelings about a friend or your social life happiness goals to the fore. It's a time of epiphanies about your need to be involved, belong, and contribute. Transits also challenge you to break out of a rut or a pattern that's been preventing you from growing and changing. However, watch for unnecessary conflicts in the process and be mindful. If you act out without self-awareness, you may be taking risks, overpaying, or jumping into, or out of, something too quickly. You've been very wrapped up in your personal life, and now you see opportunities to share your load or collaborate. Yesterday's full moon can produce a surprise, bringing warmth, emotion, and color to your social sector. There can be a sudden discovery, someone's need for your assistance, or a recognition of your feelings. Cosmic energy arrives in full glory today. This is because the sturgeon moon resounds in the heavens and will echo out until the weekend. Full moons are always felt for two days prior and linger after until their energy wanes. This lunation will be a full moon in Aquarius, highlighting your solar house of friendships, communities, and online dating. This is an excellent period to connect with others and try to meet new people, regardless if single or attached. Socializing will be important now, so even if you're coupled up, get out there. Who do you want to stay connected with? Reflect on your professional support system during the full moon in Aquarius. The lunation will conclude a six-month cycle focused on networking and friendship. You may have noticed a substantial difference in your professional community. As hard as it might be, you may want to let go of lackluster professional relationships and work friends. You will know who to let go of since these connections may undermine your authority, ideas, and aspirations. Focus on the work friends who build you up instead. You are a delightfully flexible person at times, and the planetary energy at play makes this one of those times. To emphasize this quality, consider paying special attention to stretching out your hips and legs. When you feel strong physically, your true nature shines through. Cut back on the caffeine intake, regularly substitute peppermint or chamomile tea to strengthen your nervous system. Some problems may be coming up in your prof. Cyanol life. You may be late in your undertakings or realizing a project. Today's vibrations will put some stumbling blocks in your path. So, you will have to be patient and not get upset. Jump over obstacles by being methodical, don't strain yourself and get some air. The timing of the Sun and Mercury's alignment in a playful and creative part of your chart today is significant, not just because it coincides with the pressures from a full moon that makes this a busy day with many demands on your free time. With Mercury in retrograde motion, it allows for reflection on the past and opportunities for second chances. As both planets in Aries support this process, Whatever issues or revelations arise from the full moon will come with ready-made solutions. What makes an alignment between the Sun and Mercury today significant is that Mercury is in retrograde motion. When that happens, Mercury passes between the Sun and Earth, increasing its potency and message. With both under pressure from a full moon and the spirit of romance from life's demands in general, this makes the link between heart and mind but also between the past, present and future able to deliver clearer messages. Our eyes in the sky. Friendships, like all relationships, are living, breathing connections that require care and attention. It's not just about spending time together, but about building a foundation of mutual support, trust, and understanding. If you've been feeling a disconnect with someone in your Lithia Euro, whether it's a friend, a group of people, or even a Kaliagia Euro, today might bring you the clarity you need to decide if it's time to make a change. Sometimes, relationships evolve in ways that no longer align with who we are or where we're headed, and that's okay. Letting go is never easy, but it's often necessary to make space for the kind of authentic, supportive connections that truly bring you joy. Think about a time when a friendship no longer felt right. How did you handle it? Did you have a conversation, or did you gradually distance yourself? 
Maybe you learned something valuable about yourself through that experience. Share your story others might be going through something similar and could benefit from your insights. By sharing your experiences, you could help someone else find the strength to make decisions that are right for them, too. Now, on days like today, UM. I'd feel more inclined to stay cozy in bed rather than face the world head-on. We've all been there, right? There's a strong pull towards comfort a euro, whether that's indulging in sweet dreams, binge-watching your favorite show, or treating yourself to something delicious. And you know what? A little rest and relaxation is a good thing. We all need those moments to recharge. But, as with anything, balance is key. It's easy to fall into the trap of overindulgence, and while that might feel good in the moment, it might not lead you to the results you truly want in the long run. So, instead of diving headfirst into a full day of indulgence, why not find a middle ground? You can still embrace comfort, but in ways that nurture both your body and spirit. Maybe that means going for a peaceful walk in nature or taking a few minutes to stretch and breathe deeply. These small acts of self-care can help you feel refreshed and re-energized without overdoing it. When you approach your day with this kind of balance, you might be surprised at how much easier it is to tackle your responsibilities. Even those tasks on your to-do list might not feel like work at all. And here's something magical that H. Appends when you radiate that kind of balanced, easygoing energy, people are drawn to it. They see your calm and positive attitude, and they want to share in that feeling. Sometimes, just showing up with a smile and a positive mindset can make all the difference euro, not just for you, but for the people around you, too. Have you ever noticed how infectious positivity can be? It's like a ripple effect. When you're in a good place, emotionally and mentally, that energy spreads to others, making their day a little brighter, too. But let's not forget you deserve to feel that positivity in your own life, as well. So, take a moment to check in with yourself today. Are there areas where you can bring more balance? Whether it's making sure you're getting enough rest, finding joy in simple activities, or staying connected with those who uplift you, your well-being is worth prioritizing. Spoil yourself a little, treat yourself with kindness, and make sure that positive outlook you're sharing with others is something you're cultivating within yourself, too. And as you go about your day, stay mindful of your interactions. Enjoy those chats with colleagues and loved ones, but also keep an eye on why. Our own tasks and responsibilities. Striking that balance between social connection and personal productivity is key to maintaining harmony in your life. Use your time constructively, and remember to nurture the relationships that are important to you. When you invest in both yourself and your connections, you're building a strong foundation for lasting happiness and success. So, today, embrace the clarity that comes with the full moon, make space for the relationships that truly matter and give yourself the care and attention you deserve. Whether you're taking a small step towards self-care, or a big leap towards a new beginning, know that you're on the right path.